Hi guys! So today I'm going to show you how I get my, I guess now, signature rounded top bun. Yeah, we're going to call it a rounded top bun. I posted this bun on Instagram a few times and every time I post it, I get requests for a tutorial. So here I am doing the tutorial just for you. So I'm starting off on freshly washed and conditioned hair. My hair has just been towel dried. I love to do this on freshly washed hair, but you can also do it on um, like an old twist out or an old braid out. Those come out cute too with this style. So you want to start with a leave-in. I like to use a leave-in that's lightweight and leaves your hair shiny. So uh, I'm going to be using the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil leave-in conditioner today. I change it up all the time, but today this is what I have. So this is what I'm using. And the Crystal Eco Styler Gel. And then you're just going to need a brush and a comb. And of course, a hair tie. Okay. Let's get started. Okay, we're going to start off by putting the Shea Moisture throughout our hair evenly. Throughout this process, I'm just finger detangling my hair just to get it as smooth as possible. I don't like to use combs, so we're just going to rake the product through with our fingers. Here, I'm just making sure that I have enough product in the back of my head. I know sometimes we kind of neglect that part. So make sure you put enough product at the nape of your neck in the back. Now I'm just taking the Eco Styler Gel and smoothing it all around the base of my hair. I really don't put it on the ends. I just put it on the base and smooth upward. Now I am just going to take the brush and smooth around the perimeter of my hair. This just makes it way easier to put it in a ponytail. When you have thick hair, you kind of have to prep before trying to put it up in a ponytail. Okay, now you want to take your hair tie and tie it around once and then tie it around twice. But now you're going to move the hair to the front as you see. Pull the hair over your hand and don't pull it all the way through. And so that part in the front, you just want to smooth it to the side in the back and then you just shape it the way you want. So I just shape it kind of rounded and just tuck in any excess pieces. Now I just add a little extra gel for the edges, of course. If you've been following me for a while, you know I have to slay the edges. And I do three swoops on each side. Okay, that's it. That's how you get my rounded top bun. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.